What if Alzheimer's isn't permanent? Scientists reverse cognitive decline. For more than a century, Alzheimer's disease has been treated as a one-way path, something that could perhaps be slowed, but never reversed. Research has focused almost entirely on prevention or delay, based on the assumption that once the brain is damaged, recovery is impossible. A new study challenges that assumption at its core. Instead of asking whether Alzheimer's can be prevented, researchers asked a far more radical question. Can a brain already deeply affected by Alzheimer's recover? The answer, at least in advanced preclinical models and human brain tissue, appears to be yes. The study identifies a central driver of Alzheimer's pathology, a failure to maintain healthy levels of NAD+, a molecule essential for cellular energy, repair, and survival. NAD plus naturally declines with age, but the decline is far more severe in Alzheimer's brains, leaving neurons unable to meet their basic energy demands. Using two distinct mouse models, one driven by amyloid pathology and the other by tau, the researchers found that restoring proper NAD plus balance not only prevented disease when given early, but reversed major features of Alzheimer's even when treatment began after extensive damage had already occurred. These brains didn't just stabilize, they repaired themselves. Markers of neuroinflammation normalized, blood-brain barrier integrity improved, synaptic function recovered, and oxidative damage was reduced. Even hippocampal neurogenesis, the birth of new neurons critical for memory, was restored. Most strikingly, animals with severe cognitive impairment regained full cognitive function. This recovery was also reflected in normalized levels of phosphorylated tau in the blood, a biomarker already used clinically in people, strengthening the evidence that true disease reversal had occurred. This approach does not flood the brain with excessive NAD+, which can be dangerous. Instead, it helps cells maintain the correct energy balance under stress, allowing repair without pushing metabolism into harmful territory. The implications are profound. If Alzheimer's is driven in part by a collapse in brain energy metabolism, then restoring that balance may open a path not just to slowing decline, but to recovery itself. The findings suggest that the damaged brain may retain a latent capacity to heal, if given the right biological support. This work represents a fundamental shift in how Alzheimer's might be treated in the future, not as an irreversible condition, but as one where repair and regained function may be possible. Human trials will be needed to determine whether these results translate beyond the laboratory. But the message is clear. Alzheimer's may not be as permanent as once believed. This video is based on the research paper, Pharmacologic Reversal of Alzheimer's Disease in Mice Reveals Potential Therapeutic Nodes in Human Brain by Kalyani Chobe et al. in Cell Reports Medicine. What do you think about these findings? Drop us a comment below. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more neuroscience news updates.